The new system that we have put in, it, it really allows us to be be our own quarterbacks on defense. We make our own, we can, we can do a lot of our own things. And so it allows us to be really aggressive. And also we can play, play based on like the wide receivers that are playing against their talents and stuff. So I think we, um, with guys like Nick Ballore, Matt Burning, we have a lot of guys back. Our front, our front four is going to be deep. And our secondary, we feel like we, we're putting our four best athletes, four of the best athletes on the team out there in the secondary. So Vince, so. Is a, he's been a great leader um, this, thus far. He's a great worker. He's uh, got a great passion to play. He's, uh, he's, been, he's been tremendous. He's had a very good spring. I know our defensive coaches uh, every day would, would uh, rave about how he played. And um, we feel very, very good about him uh, being out there. And uh, he got dinged up the other day a little bit, and he didn't practice. But he had practiced about the first 10 or 11 practices. and. Um, he's very consistent. He's tough. Um, he can play the ball in the air, and uh, you know we're expecting a, a big season out of him. We've got a lot on our shoulders. We got a lot of guys that played a lot of football on the defensive side of the ball. Um, I'd like to see the offense do as well as we do, and we both do really well and have a great season. But um, you know we want to do everything we can as a defense to get our offense, you know, back on the field and uh, doing what they've been doing for the last couple of years here. Um, our defense staff, defensive staff does a tremendous job, all of them, um, getting our guys to play with great technique. Um, getting to play with great effort, and you know, one of the one of the things I've been saying since I've arrived here was one of the reasons why um, CMU won 12 games last year. They obviously had a great offense, but um, their defense, in my opinion, finally matched their offense, and uh, that was why they had the ability to win 12 games, which is obviously not many people are doing that every uh, year. You know, their and, uh, coaching styles are looking more and more the same as we keep going. Uh, obviously, some things are going to look different on the field, but uh, you know, at the end of the day, you get the same kind of results. Uh, you know. Great coaching staff, real involved with us. You know, real close knit team, which is what we've always had. Uh, so not much has changed. We'll still we'll still see some of the same stuff. We'll still spread it out and we'll still throw it up a little bit. Um, Coach Enos made he's done everything he can to make this transition really well, and he's worked really hard with the seniors. Had a lot of meetings and stuff just because with the new staff, you know, they don't know exactly what all the players are thinking. The players don't really know what they're thinking, so we have a lot of meetings and we relay the thoughts back and forth to the players and stuff like that. So we've had a good transition.